Lack of clean drinking water is a global problem. In 2017, 884 million people worldwide did not have access to safe to drink water. Oftentimes, finding clean sources of water, collecting the water, transporting it, and then keeping it clean can all be a challenge. However, darkling beetles have inspired an interesting potential solution. Warka Towers, developed by the organization Warka Water. Darkling beetles are a group of beetles that live in the Namib Desert, off of the coast of Africa. This is one of the most arid regions in the world. The beetles have micro bumps and grooves on their wings. They also have regions that are hydrophobic, so they repel water, and hydrophilic, so they attract water. Water from the atmosphere, from fog or from dew, condenses on the bumps and grooves of the beetle's wings. The hydrophobic and hydrophilic regions then help direct the droplets of water straight into the beetle's mouth. Some species of darkling beetles will even raise their wings so they face into oncoming foggy winds. This behavior, called fog basking, makes them even more efficient at collecting water. This ability to collect water out of the atmosphere is what inspired Warka Towers. Warka Towers are able to collect water from the atmosphere, from fog, humidity, dew, or rain. The outer structure of the tower are stiff materials that are connected in a loose woven pattern. The materials used can be whatever is easy to access for the people in the region where the tower is being built. So for some communities, bamboo is used. Inside this outer layer is a cool mesh, which provides a surface for water droplets to condense on. Eventually, the water droplets flow down the mesh into a reservoir below, where they provide a source of clean drinking water for the community. The organization Warka Water explains, no matter what the weather or climate conditions are, there's always some amount of water in the atmosphere. However, Warka Towers are most efficient in places where there's lots of fog or high levels of humidity. When you look at a Warka Tower, it's a tall, imposing, structural creation. It's hard to imagine it all began with a little beetle. But they do say, big things come in small packages. Hi, this is Denise from C2ST. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, please make sure to follow, like, and subscribe. Also, be sure to hit the bell icon so you'll be notified when a new video is posted. Doing all of this makes sure that our videos are more visible to other STEM enthusiasts on YouTube.